tracks then go crazy. What's going on, my good folks? It's your man, your guy, your boy. 1127 Kicks. I hope everybody out there is having a great day, an amazing day, and overall a blessed day. Say, man, if you're new to the channel, do your boy a huge favor. Hit that like button. Go ahead and subscribe to the page. And if you're already with the movement, bro, I greatly appreciate you, man. Hit that like button. Share this video. And let's go ahead and keep this page growing. So, man, as y'all see, man, I did something a little different. We outside with it today, man. Just out here chilling. You feel me? So, I hope y'all like this, man. Let me know how y'all feel about this. If y'all want me to do more videos outside, do y'all like the quality of the videos? Just let me know, man. So, with that being said right there, man, your boy's on the way to 3K subscribers before the end of the year i'm at 26 and some change right now man so if you're watching this make sure you hit that subscribe button it's for free bro help your boy get to 3k man and also throughout the video man i will have cards up you can check out my kitchen talks sneaker unboxing you know on foot reviews pretty much sneaker updates and everything like that man so make sure y'all go ahead and just you know tap in with your boy subscribe to the page like the page help it grow and let's keep this thing going so with that being said right there man december 12th mm, december 12th for a retail price of 220 dollars man we have these air jordan 11 jubilee joints are the 25th anniversary that are dropping man 10 a.m easter time and once again that's going to be december 12th now just getting into this shoe real quick man as you know pretty much all black upper air jordan right here man you got that nice you know patent leather going around the shoe and stuff like that you got that mesh material on there you got that white mid so with that milky bottom which really resembles you know the air jordan 11 72 and 10s that we got a few years back you have that plated jump man on there as well man now instead of being a red plated jump man that we got on the wind like 72s this is silver with a pretty much a silver plated 23 on the back of the shoe as well and then we have jordan going down the eyelets of the shoe or what the lace locks or however you want to put it so overall this shoe is not bad at all i don't i'm not bashing the shoe or whatever but if you watch my copper drop video on the shoe man pretty much i said if you have the wind like 72s if you have the space jams i feel like this shoe is really not needed but at the same time bro if you don't have any of those i feel like this is a solid pickup until the space jams come back out or if we get a retro to win like 72s but anyway that's just the overall view of the shoe right there man now we finna talk about how you can cop this shoe now if you're new to the page man if you haven't seen my how to cops man we're gonna talk about resale where you can find the shoe my predictions of the shoe man and everything of that nature right there man so sit back and post up and just keep on enjoying this video right here so off the rip looking at stock x man the prices on here is really not that bad it's really not that bad it's a little higher than what i actually thought so what i'm pretty much seeing is pretty much like like 320 and up 310 and up something like that man now that size seven and seven and a half is definitely looking good in my personal opinion those are some sizes that i would really go for if you're trying to resell then after that it's looking like that 11 and a half on up if i'm not mistaken is looking very well and that 12 and a half is looking very very nice on StockX, man and once again like i always say in my how to cop videos before it used to be size seven through nine was the money sizes for you to get if you was going to resell the shoe seven through nine those are very common sizes and stuff like that those are the sizes that you go for now i don't know what happened within the last year you know but it's looking like 11 and a half on up or you know even better sizes to get right there so if you could touch that seven that seven and a half and you could touch 11 and a half on up especially at 12 and a half I really feel like you're gonna be in a ballpark to really resell the shoe for a great price that's just in my personal opinion right there and once again i'm a little shocked about how much they're actually going for right now even though we're a few days out of out of the side of the release and everything like that but it's looking pretty decent and overall it's looking like you know whatever size you get you could at least pocket a hundred dollars so hey when it comes to that i feel like you really can't lose now as far as goat goes goat prices are up there for this shoe now once again that size seven that seven and a half is looking good then you got a few more sizes in there then it kind of balances out and then when it gets to that 11 and a half if i'm not mistaken on up it goes to those crazy prices again man so once again seven and seven and a half 
and men's those are rare sizes to find especially a size seven so if you can touch a seven or a seven and a half you are definitely in the ballpark and if you touch 11 and a half on up you are in the ballpark to really resell this shoe for a great price bro i'm telling you if you get that if you get any of those sizes you can really resell this shoe for a great price man and once again it's looking like this shoe is going to resell for pretty much like 320 plus almost so with that being said right there you really can't lose because once again you do have people like me that's it that's going to say well i got the space jams i got this i got that well everybody else don't ha doesn't have the space jams well i sold my space jams but you know you got a lot of people who don't have space jams or don't have one like 72s and stuff and this is the christmas 11 so this shoe will hold some type of weight and people will pay their money for it especially because it's christmas time and you know maybe they want to have a pair for their wife their kids or something like that man so people gonna pay that money that you that you set your price at as long as it's not too crazy you'll definitely be straight now as far as where you could find this shoe and things of that nature now i will have a story list up man y'all already know i'm gonna have a story list up there for a minute but there's some stories on there that's actually missing um i know champs they're get they're getting the shoe every um every shoe that's part every store that's part of the flex reservation foot locker foot action champs all of them they're they're going to get the shoe as well and you can actually start reserving your shoe now so make sure you get on your foot locker app your foot action app champs east bay and go ahead and start you know trying to reserve your shoes man use your head start points and things of that nature so you can give yourself the best chance to actually get this shoe as far as when it comes to those stores right there and then finish line they did their raffle as well i took an l on my size and my wife's size i'm really not too big on getting them but if i could you know what i'm saying i'm still a you know i'm still a shoe head bro i still love them so i was at least going to see what they look like in hand possibly do a giveaway you never know but uh finish line they just gave out gave out their raffle winners so if you hit on finish line man double salute to you man shout out to you and congratulations on securing your pair but after that you know you have dtlr snipes uh jd sports i believe jd sports is on there as well man you have jimmy jazz you have chic that's getting the shoe hippie sports is getting the shoe or city gear is going to get the shoe man there's a lot of places out here that's actually getting this shoe and honestly this this will be a widely available shoe now would i just sit there and say sleep on it and you know and take it lightly not at all but at the same time if the shoe was releasing on dick sporting goods bro <laughs> on dicks bro pause like check this out man that shoe is this is a widely available shoe man so with that being said i just will say don't put all your eggs in one basket man don't all the way depend on the sneakers app don't all the way depend on full locker and stuff like that man make sure you know you you try to tap into the other websites and everything like that because it would definitely will be spread out bro everybody's not going to be going to the same website like my like the homie d got juice he always hits on finish line you feel me he's gonna rock with finish line before you rock with foot locker foot action or whatever he's gonna go with finish line so you got some people who actually got their sites and stuff where that's where they hit they hit no matter what so that's what they gonna roll with you know what i'm saying so definitely you know with that being said right there it will be spread out so you don't have to throw all your eggs in one basket if you take an l on sneakers out which i hope you don't i wish i hope you caught the first time but if you do man you can still go to other places and definitely get a dub man but make sure you have your payment information good to go make sure you have your billing information good to go man do not sleep on that do not take that lightly bro because that happens to a lot of us man if you uh was on the sneakers app today and you was trying to get resale to j balvin joints man and you were size 10 but you wanted to go for a size 9 make sure you change your size back to a size 10 so it can register you know what i'm saying in the nike uh sneakers app and stuff like that so you won't get sent the wrong size it's all those little things that you have to do right there but overall man i feel like that this shoe would be very smooth to cop in my personal opinions it's not an ugly shoe and everything it's just not needed for my collection personally but it's not ugly at all i think the shoe is definitely dope man and once again man i feel like if you get a seven seven and a half eleven and a half on up on StockX or goat you're really up in there in the game as far as you know really capitalizing on resale but if you if you don't want to do that man if you just get other sizes you're still looking at 300 and up bro so you honestly looking at an extra hundred dollars in your pocket which you know hey man everybody can use the extra hundred dollars you feel what i'm saying so you have that and this shoe once again releasing on foot locker foot action champs east bay uh finish line jimmy jazz dtlr snipes Hibbit Sports, Dick Sporting Goods, man, Chic, 
a lot of websites getting this shoe, man. I probably missed out some of them, man, but make sure y'all keep on checking your boy out man i hope this video was very very informational for y'all man let me know how y'all feel about the shoe in the comment section below are y'all going for the shoe are y'all good on it are y'all really reselling the shoe or is this shoe for the toe man let me know how y'all feel man i greatly appreciate y'all i want to say i love y'all i thank y'all man stay blessed stay safe justice for george floyd as always y'all already know how we finna end the video off if you search for good you shall find a favor if you search for evil shall find you proverbs 11 27 and we walk in faith and not by sight for what is seen is temporary what is unseen is forever i live by that i stand by that man y'all stay blessed y'all stay safe and it's your boy 11 27 kicks and always remember bless your feet with something who did hit me up and told me shit on these niggas Tell these niggas out here came back to going Showing the different keep on dropping all of that shit That made these folks wanna listen You know these niggas hate fucking tell a get out of